a very funny example was uh, this is a creator from the south we represent called madan gauri he's the biggest creator in tamil nadu um and chennai um he's got about 4 and 1/2 million subscribers uh but when when we got him on board he didn't have any pr around him and uh, suddenly uh, like uh, he he started coming up in magazines and newspapers and things like that and he posted that on his feed and on his social media that's when people actually started uh, dming him that bro you're in newspapers you're a big deal i'm like bro he had 4 and 1/2 million subscribers did you not think he was big enough a deal then but um, yeah. right when he is like on a newspaper or a magazine you you start that perception building is completely different right so pr is another aspect that we really help for creators with um the third aspect is collaborations one with creators uh, because we have a network of creators we are already in touch with and we feel like we could um, you know open those warm leads for creators um who may be up and coming uh, but also besides that uh, we have really strong ties with platforms right so all platforms like instagram youtube um facebook snapchat all of these guys we have very strong ties with so if you have something very um you know urgent that's popped up your account gets hacked for example uh you know we could just connect the person immediately to the platform and ensure that the problem gets solved um or if you're shadow banned or you know whatever 10000 other reasons that you might need to connect to the platform immediately that's something uh we provide on the back end very quickly uh because we also have enterprise access in certain places because we represent a bunch of like uh, creators uh, together so those are certain aspects i feel like um uh, creators need to sort of um, have external help with as well um so I- i've also seen this ecosystem where a lot of bloggers especially um are just building their own teams or hiring say one intern uh, to yeah. figure out um, you know their brand details and brand work and stuff like that while that is uh, good and to each their own i feel like um, at an agency level what you could pull off um, and uh, you'd know that by running like a creative production agency as well this is completely different as opposed to what a freelancer say would be able to pull off so if you enjoyed that clip check out the entire episode on the ivm podcast app website or wherever you get your podcast from